getting ahead of the curve will help tremendously. So, you know, anticipating, um, hey, it's starting to get warm out there. This is a neighborhood that has tremendous odorous house ant pressure and getting ahead of it um, will help you get, get more out of your applications. But then also um, being really smart about what applications you're making. And one thing that I've really started exploring just in the last couple of years with a lot of my research trials is hitting ants with a sprayable and a bait that contain the same active ingredient. And so an example of this would be Avion WDG and Avion ant bait, because they both have endoxicarb. And at that point, you're getting ants to trail through the same active ingredient as they're eating. And so the, the idea with any active ingredient in terms of ant control is to get the threshold of, get above the threshold of that active ingredient in the colony. So this being shared through trophallaxis it's um, getting to the brood, it's getting to the queen, and you have to reach a critical threshold before that really happens. And by using multiple formulations in terms of sprayables and baits to deliver that same active and get a large enough dose to achieve that result, um, I think is a great strategy and we're seeing that pan out in the research trials that we're doing. And so another example of a good combination would be the tandem for OptiGuard Flex and then using OptiGuard Ant. Um, both with thigh and oxen. So, you know, it's one of these kinds of things where I think once you decide what active you're using in that area, you can get that active into the colony through different routes that really can provide a pretty significant um, impact on your control efforts.